limits tourism. It is often called by urban explorers who trespass into tunnels, abandoned buildings, and even bridges around the world. Here at UC Berkeley, we have our own culture of off-limits tourism, of the steam tunnels that exist under our campus. These steam tunnels run the length of Schlesinger Way and Campanile Way beginning at the central heating plant. The main purpose of the steam pipes in the tunnels is to provide power, steam, and hot water for the campus. And the tunnels themselves also carry utility cables. Information about the tunnels and urban exploration in general has proliferated on the internet. On a webpage titled Under Cal, two Cal alums who had gone into the steam tunnels described it to be a toasty 100 degree Fahrenheit with close to 100% humidity. A columnist for Daily Cal described the tunnels as definitely not a claustrophobe's dream. That's definitely on the list of uh, things in Berkeley that at one point or another, I guess, you could go into. With the wealth of information shared by hackers on the internet also comes an administrative response. Vice Chancellor Ron Coley at the time responded in a letter back to the Daily Cal that the tunnels are not toys and carry dangers of high pressure steam burns, exposure to asbestos and electrocution. The grates were previously kept unlocked for the safety of the tunnel maintenance workers, but since then the physical plant has supposedly locked all grates and now the tunnels are inaccessible. Steam tunnel systems are common under university campuses nationwide. In California, Caltech, UCLA, and UCSD all boast extensive steam tunnel networks and underground exploration traditions. But until new ways are discovered to access Berkeley's steam tunnels, some have found other sources of urban exploration. So like there's some abandoned buildings in Berkeley and uh, there's actually these old uh, mine shafts. It's kind of exciting to, uh, what's the word? Uh, you know, urban decay and things like that, you know, stuff that's just been, you know, if you go into a place, there's sometimes things that have been there for like 60 years, you know, it's kind of like a time capsule almost. In Berkeley for Cal TV, this is Lucy Yu. Thank you.